eating him wouldn't really be a crime, right? I uh, cannibalism. Look, maybe, <laughs> maybe, maybe the king is just a, a piece of piece of ham. After the mm. previous king died, they elected I don't know the nearest apple. All right, uh, let's see. Okay. So we can be a lot of different things. I know there's a bunch of classes that can be unlocked. Yeah, yeah. so I'm gonna have this, the basic ones. I think I've got a lot of them. <laughs> yeah, now, I was kind of tempted to uh, play some and prep or get some extra currency, but I just do not have time for that sort of thing. It takes a lot of work to get the currency and the payouts are mostly in the end game. Now, since, it are you gonna be a minstrel and you're going to be an herbalist? Because if that's the case, then I should probably be something a bit more physical. I don't really know what kind of balance uh, we're trying to strike. So, whoever's in middle will tend to take more damage overall, because you'll be more frequently hit by the moves that hit two people. Mm -hmm. um, so having, having a tanky character in the middle space is good. The herbalist will play the int-based caster stuff, so Scholar and I would be potentially competing for items. I don't think that's necessarily game-breaking, but if you wanted to play Minstrel or Hunter, that might make it a little bit easier to distribute stuff. Okay. I could also and... play someone else if you were committed to Scholar. I, I don't think the Scholar is that interesting, though. I'd say you could play Herbalist if you could, but probably my characters don't extend to both of you, do they? I was most interested in probably the Minstrel or the oh, Hunter. Yeah. Minstrel. So... Those are both great. Both are really strong. Now, I think the hunter's probably smart, stronger, but the minstrel was a lot of fun. So is the hunter just ranged attack and traps, or do they have any animal handling or something else involved? So the thing that makes the hunter good is that you can ambush stuff, which means that you can get the first several hits in before a combat starts. And the hunter's really good at taking advantage, first doing it and then taking advantage of it. Um, the minstrel is cool because you've got a number of weapons and items you can use that kind of play differently. So there's some more variety to what the minstrel gets on that. And you have some more like support team buff things that like can activate. Also gold gain. Mm -hmm. Now I assume the minstrel is typical buffs and stuff as well, right? Almost like a bard. Yeah. I, um, the minstrel's buff is mostly making people like succeed on stuff. Mm -hmm. um, like it'll increase our accuracy on things. Um, okay, I don't. Hey. So I, I don't know if I should have a more active role. Maybe the hunter would be a little bit more active as opposed to the minstrel. But who knows? Go for either. Both are active. Go for, why don't you go for Hunter Shell? Okay, I mean, that's what I'm currently dressed up as. Yeah, I, I think you're a scholar. You're, you're Wait, currently really? set as scholar. Yeah, it's oh, below oh, your never name. Mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was getting my character prepared and I thought that I was. There's Hunter. Oh, there, yeah. there we go. So now just make your character not terrifying. Uh huh. <laughs> you mean like, like yours, Wander? <laughs> Look. <laughs> <laughs> I'm All change right. my facial hair. Can you change those eyes, though? That was what I was thinking about. No. They're so intense. <laughs> Why are you the nearest apple? I, in reference to the fact that they crowned the nearest apple as king. <laughs> uh, Look, uh, I'm going you? to be self-referential in within this episode if I can possibly manage it. Are you the king? Is that what I'm getting? No, I don't know. Okay. It was just like, what should I name myself so I'm not just Wanderbot? Nearest Apple. I, I want to believe that you're like first in line for the crown after the queen, who I think is in charge. And they're like, look, like, we let's don't send like him out on a suicide much, mission. So let's send Get him on rid a suicide him. mission. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I'll call mostly myself Artemis. She's always my favorite Greek goddess and archery suits her. You want to read the lore shell? Oh, the brink of chaos. The good king Bronner has been slain. The once peaceful kingdom of Favrul has been corrupted by the wild chaos energy and ravaged by monsters and bandits. 
the grieving queen Rosamond has called for Farul's ordinary citizens to search the land for the king's murderer and the source of the chaos energy. The tale now begins in the Guardian Forest, where there have been rumors of suspicious activity and sinister strangers in the woods. Three would-be heroes meet in Orton to begin their quest. Swoop. Oh, Roseman, Queen of Farul. First the wizard Vexa vanishes, and then my own husband was slain in his palace. You may be the last hope of Farul. Seek out Hildebrandt in Woodsmoke. You'll be told how to best aid our efforts. Your quest has begun. Strive against this chaos, lest our realm be consumed by it. Quest objectives? Go to Woodsmoke in the Guardian Forest. All right, then. Click to continue. Oh, interesting. So is this similar to Armello then? Where you yeah, select yeah. spaces to travel to? and I would I would say it's kind of comparable to Co-op Armello, but it doesn't have the deck builder elements. Mm-hmm. Now, it looks like I have four places that I can move. Yeah. I can so already you engage four, in so combat you can on the I first. Think five, actually. Wait, five? Let me see how far I can extend. Oh, I yeah, you're right. Five over your number, so. Yeah. Huh. So yeah. if you want to head for the Beast Man or the Hag, we kind of want to fight as many things as we possibly can to a lesser degree. I mean, wait, I guess... we have to engage her in combat? We don't have to, but we will definitely not level if we don't fight things. Yes. I and just feel bad. So she's a witch. Now there's a stone hero tribute received full focus plus 12 XP. Yeah. So focus is something that you use to buff your rolls. I think it, it gives like, you an extra die. Did you already use one? Did you use one for the movement? This is just what I was given. Okay. Your, your focus just started at two rather than okay, three. Okay. So she so might have, she might have clicked already. the wrong thing. Yeah. So if, if you right click instead of left click, it'll like use focus. And so oh. for example, if you wanted to like guarantee your movement were like higher, you use a focus and it will guarantee one of the rolls and it'll increase the chance of success for all the other rolls by 10%. Oh, I accidentally used it because I thought that I was to, you know, right click to drag the screen around or mm. something. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted to clarify that in case you hadn't noticed. It was a good thing to pay attention to. It's not oh. a big deal. One focus is like, you, you'll get them back. Like they, they come, they go. All right. So should I attack someone or should I go to the statue? Uh, um, I would wait on the statue if that's full focus. Yeah, mm -hmm. I probably attack something, use focus to ambush it, and so then go to the statue and like get yeah. one to attack the beast man. Uh, yeah, sure. Beast man or hag, both are good yeah. candidates, I think. I would go for the beast man for you, seeing as you move, you move faster. One of us might roll lower, and you should All be right. able to include us in combat. So you want to ambush this one, and probably okay. use a focus for it to increase the success of ambush chance. Um, okay. So I have a 77% success. It's okay. You're on sneak. Make sure um, you're on ambush shell. Oh, I, I did press. Oh, okay. It's just showing sneak. I failed. Yeah, bad luck. Wait, are we not in this combat? No, that's what I was worried about ambushing for. Yeah, that was, that was why I was thinking maybe you'd want to use two, but um. Okay. Well, it I looks think like you I should can... be okay, but I guess it's on journeyman, so probably all of my intuition about what's careful enough is probably not quite careful enough. So I have a snipe shot and a standard shot, but well, we're concerned where she gets just absolutely. Uh, beasted here, and we just start over on Apprentice. Oh gosh, why does it look like I'm bleeding for using more focus? Are, or no, I'm bleeding, bleeding because I'm bleeding. Yeah, you got hit, and the attack inflicted bleeding. But there's a pixie with him, isn't that interesting? Yeah, so the reason the two of them are fighting is because, like you, the um, enemies will work together. Ah, uh, he's protected. So I could 
ignores armor. Is he is he currently armored when he has those around him? I I don't think. Okay, he's protected. Fully negates all that. damage from the next attack. You can mouse over these. Oh. Yeah, but I I'm see. not. I'm not. I think that means that an armor piercing attack will not get past that. Oh, and I can't select the pixie. You can. Or can I? You can. Really? Yeah. How you absolutely do I can. Do that though, because it looks like I just so we'll, immediately shot for him last yeah, time. Yeah, if you you have to like kind of click on the pixie rather than on the. Like, oh, there we go. All right. So it looks like I still have a shot or a snipe shot. Uh, this is like really early to do something like this, but given that this combat might go south. Go south, I should flee. Um, yeah, I was thinking flee or use your evasion item, but like maybe just flee. Okay, yeah. I mean, I was taken unawares. You didn't know that you'd be approaching or yeah, that you um, would be out of, left out of the combat, I should say. Just look at, so yeah, uh, that's why the ambush is good is because it would put you in a one-on-one -on -one and you would have gotten two attacks beforehand. Looking at your current focus level, it looks like you didn't use a focus point to try and ambush them. So, oh, really? I, I had pressed the right the right click on it. If you switch to another thing and then switch back, it'll undo that effect. Oh, so I needed to have clicked on it again. I think that, yeah. I see. The, it, admittedly, probably the like main downsides with this game. And then w once you're done, you can hit end turn. Oh, end turn. Which um, is just, just enter space. I, I forget if there's a hotkey. It's in the upper right hand corner though for the button, but. Oh, just the, the little hourglass. Okay. Oh, I see. So I've got three moves. Can I go after the beast man now? I think, no. <laughs> I think you could hit the hag and shell might be able to help. Oh, you got nice day though. Okay, now you got a random movement boost. Hmm. Okay, I see how this works. So anybody within two tiles of the thing we're trying to fight. They will join can... combat then? Yeah. So, okay. Shell, do you want to try and fight this again, or should we, wait for, should we wait for Nathan? I mean, we could probably fight it. Does it still have the damage that I inflicted on it last turn, or is it going to heal up? I think so the danger so you'll run into is I think that might pull the hag to this time. So it might ah, be a two on okay. three. Oh, there's a tag on the other Whereas side of the village. And if, then there's also I the get, pixie. If I get my next turn, I might be able to come in and help on it too. Uh, oh, that didn't going work. <laughs> I, <laughs> You're attacking I apologize. I, I was, what I was trying to do, what I, what I was trying to do is move to an empty tile down below, and I was like, okay, move down, because it said it was a, a valid tile to move oh, to. Oh, and the hag has joined. And the beastman is back up to full health. Well, yeah, let's... Yeah, that does happen. Do we want to just chuck ourselves into this and then maybe bop down to apprentice mode? I think there's a good chance you can take him as a two-on-three. Okay. I, I thought the two-on-one looked kind of scary, but, like, two-on-three... Yeah, better odds. Take out that beast man. Yeah, trying to decide. <laughs> nice. That's Oof. a trick. So by the way, uh, in regards to Shell using her focus to move, I think what happened is she rolled two regular moves, and then the third... Uh, oh, I didn't mean to do physical or that, but oh well. Um, Ow. The extra movement that she went past what she normally would have... Was from focusing. Yeah, was what cost her the focus. It, it's The arrow is still embedded in her. That's yeah, they stick silly. around. Oh yeah, they stick around until combat's over. Okay. Got her down. Hopefully I don't get massacred by the pixie. Ooh, getting close. Pixie Fortunately, hurts. you're both next to town, so you can go there and rest next. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, she dodged it. Ah. You better hit her. There we go. Nice. Ow. We got gold coins. And a feathered nice. hat. Should I equip it? Uh, probably. That seems yeah, more a you thing than me. It's about as good on anyone here, I think. It just definitely looks like a Robin Hood-esque hat. <laughs> yeah. Especially with all the feathers in it. Yep. Always good to see new faces join the quest. I'm Hildebrandt, the Queen's agent overseeing things at the Guardian Forest. Things are really bad here. Really bad. All signs point to some evil folk who've locked themselves away in the glittering mines. I'll work on getting you down there. In the meantime, a strange contraption's been spotted. Go investigate it. Some angry folks in fancy robes have made themselves right at home. Best prepare for a good fight. Cultists! Okay, right. services. In. I think, or... Most amount of HP and focus, or... Probably the inn. I think the inn is the best. Yeah. Because you heal a ton and you get two focus off of it. Yeah. All right. I don't think I'm going to need to heal up immediately. I might just go fight this hag. I don't think the camp will help. Oh, and Shell should be able to. Oh, oh, that may be a bad thing. <laughs> I I'm pretty injured. That's um, the unfortunate thing. I think if I ambush her, I think we're probably going to be fine. Does that sound good? What about the cultists that materialize behind me? They're going to be way me. stronger, and we're going to want both of you healed and all three of us in that combat. So my hope is both of you can heal, and I'll just, like, be on the other side of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, Sound good? so you're just going to go stand next to them? I was going to try and ambush this hag. Oh, I think if I ambush her successfully, I think I'll use two focus on this. I think it might just be me, but we'll... S it might be all of no, us. No, no, no. Shell's, Shell's, Shell's absolutely on the list. Oh, yep, okay, there I am. Okay, we're still here. Yeah, see how we all th we get to act three times before she does, so mm -hmm. we're pretty likely to succeed. <laughs> now it looks like I do have an item. Use it during oh, that's just to gain yeah. evasion. Nah. The evasion is nice. Um, I I wouldn't pull it here. Yeah. Yeah, Maybe use it when you need fight. it. There we go. Oh, yep. You murdered that woman. Kind of grisly how the bones came out. So did you just share <laughs> the gold? or? I, I always what? hit share. Unless yep. someone gets a gold plus item. Mine is two max health, poison immunity, curse immunity. All right. Hmm. I'll, I'll collect that. I think that's probably good, but maybe... All right, so I should go to town, correct? Yeah. Oh, I should have given you the gold and seen if you could buy anything. Take a look at what the shops are, but also um, pick up whatever uh, the a, quest is. Yeah, there's a quest in the quest board that I forgot about. Yeah. Quest board? So we have bounties, reduce chaos, there's I items, gold, exploration, gold. I think, I think bounties are good because you get both the fight and the gold tends to be pretty rewarding. It's a little so, tough, maybe, but... There's one that's going to have a blessed vest, which is plus three armor, plus three resistance, plus two health regeneration. Curse think, immunity. So the main thing any item we'd get won't really carry well, whereas gold we get now can be used to buy the um, god serve, uh, which are healing items that'll be useful later, and mm -hmm. also experience. Um, I think the reduced chaos is also good, because it looks like chaos goes up a lot faster on this difficulty. Oh, so will chaos, say, strengthen or create more enemies in a I particular region? Yeah. yeah. That's what I'm thinking. So do you guys want gold or do you want to reduce chaos? I'm. Or do we just accept multiple? Can we accept multiple? We can only accept one. Ah. I'm between bounty gold and reduce chaos. How about let's... We can go with let's reduce go chaos. No? Chaos? Oh, gold? Right. Okay. Bounty gold? Uh okay. We're going to have a couple. I think if we kill these cultists this is for here, 30 gold. I think that'll reduce. This is for a rabid war bear. Yeah, that'll be fine. Okay. Yeah. Let's go with that one. I'm just thinking think gold can... gets us. Oh, that's a ways away anyway. 
That's fine. We'll have to go over to that device right by it, so we'll just hit it up while we're there. Okay, and Looks then... Looks like there's Castle Vacker, too. also use the inn. Yes, definitely. To replenish my HP. There we go. Yeah, see how that's, like, almost all your health? Mm -hmm. I never use the full heal. <laughs> um, I think we want to hit this chaos camp. The I one don't... immediately yeah. behind us. I don't so... think we want to do it without Shell, though. So I'd, I'm yeah. not sure she can reach it from there. So I'm just going to stand here. Okay. Okay. And I got another nice day. Yay. <laughs> well, <laughs> that's that. Wait. Oh, no, 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 no. Why did... Why did... Well, that's stupid. All right, hit up the tower. That makes sense. I could use because I I wasted all of my extra focus. Oh, do we want to fight the dire crow swarm? Ooh. Ooh, do I participate? Yeah, you would. It'd be you but and so me versus wolf. a dire crow storm and a timber wolf. A crow it's storm. It's not bad. Hmm. Okay. So you see that sanctum of life up there? Yeah. One of us can focus that, and it gives a bonus max health and max health regeneration. Wow, that's good. Probably um, me? Yeah, it's tricky because you are the toughest. You'll have the most HP and the most armor. Yeah. Okay. Maybe not. I don't know. Let's dive yeah. into this one. We'll see how it goes. Oh. They're all uh, there. Let's see. Should I go for ambush or just fight? Um, Your ambush chances are terrible, I think. <laughs> yeah, they're pretty bad. Um, so unless you're going to sink a lot of focus into it, which I think we want to save for the next fight. I think... Oh, <laughs> they all go first, don't they? Oh. Uh, yeah, the, I mean, they are very swift forest creatures. Well, if we get lucky, I, we I can just... I crows first, right? Yeah. Well, I aim for the... AOE, right? Yeah, I'm going to do the AoE if you hit the crow on the right for any amount of damage. I'll do that. Is that enough? <laughs> uh, it should be, unless this goes bad. Let's I think you might level from this, and that might be enough for you to gain focus back again. So. Whoa! Nice. That was an explosion of feathers. Good. <laughs> you murdered the murder. Oh. Guess I should have used my focus last turn. <laughs> oh well. Oh well. I'll take all of that, thank you. <laughs> I find the low poly construction of this game rather interesting oh. because everything's comprised of triangles. And yeah, sometimes you have uh, rhombuses as well, but it's okay. interesting. What are you mulling over? Oh. Me? I actually have no idea how to end my turn. Uh, oh, oh, up. button upper right. Oh, there Our it glass. is. Okay. Yep. I was trying to do it earlier. I was like right clicking on myself, which used all my focus on movement. And it's like, well. <laughs> uh, Shell, I think using your focus on ambushing them will be better than saving it for the combat. Okay. So you want me to ambush the chaos leader? I think so. Yeah. I think we're in good position for that. They're currently level one and we're all level zero, so it's probably going to be a tough fight, but I might use my god herbs to uh, party heal us, and that should Okay, help so I click on them first. Oh, it's and... my yeah. turn, though. Oh, it is your turn. So, yeah. Why I think don't I'm you just go back to end... Orton? I'm going to end turn. No, oh, no, no, no. Go, go, to Orton. go back to Orton and pick up the quest, because they got a quest there. Okay, but I and... won't. Oh, yeah. And I'll, then I'll you'll have one more movement. Range, I? Yeah. So you'll be able to go back within range. So we will have to complete all the quests before they run out of time, but I think we have enough time, probably. Yeah. How do we feel? Bounty, reduce chaos. Bounty. Uh, gold. Up to you. I like gold oh. just because we're going to be resting in the inn a lot. <laughs> yeah, I'll take the gold one. All right. That's fine. Ah, the bandit. All right. And hopefully that's close enough. Okay. So it looks like I can attack, but it looks like 
Wait a minute. Chaos Leader, that's... engage combat with multiple enemies. I can choose to ambush them when I click on them, correct? Yeah, right. once you get there, it'll give you the ambush option. All right, so ambush. How much focus should I put into it? I have a 68% success. 86 looks a lot Yeah, go better. for the 86. I don't like just doing two on that ambush. Yeah, yeah. that's what I'm doing. Okay, so I, I do it, ambush. There we, there we go. go. Succeeded. Um, so it will probably give you a bunch of turns in the beginning. Oh, look, they, they, they speak. They do. There's more of you. You should really consider joining us instead. Um, so we want to kill one of the two. Uh, uh, Chaos Acolyte. So, so I do 10 the to right. the center and 5 to the sides. Yeah. Is the guy on the left a spell? Well, wait, wait, was he going to gout flames at us? Or what are their... No, he's just particular... got a torch. I think the torch will burn you, whereas the pitchfork might have armor piercing. I don't know. I, I say that um, hit the guy with the pitchfork. I think he's the one with... Or that one has 16 health. Yeah. Okay, so, hit, so he's hit that probably... one twice, and then we might be able to finish them off. Nice. Right. Oh, critical. Again. <laughs> oh, well, wait, because I got a critical, I can attack again. No, no, because no, you ambushed, ambushed, you get to go first. Ambush, that was the ambush move, I see. I think the ambush gives you a free turn, but I think you probably just outspeed all of them, too. Uh, so I dodged, but... Okay, interesting. Yeah. You have an evade <laughs> chance, which is listed in green uh, on the lower left side of your... Mm -hmm. All right, I think I'm just going to try and pick off the one with the pitchfork. Yeah, go for it. Okay. Yeah, we don't need the party heal yet. <laughs> All right, so I should go for the secondary accolade after... Oh, actually, it's Wander's turn, so... So the left one's got a... only no armor, whereas the middle one has armor. I So should I pierce through armor? I think... Um, attack the leftmost one because it'll be easier to take down. Ah. Uh, mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Unless your armor piercing looks really effective, but... It's perfect. 31% equals ignore armor. That's pretty low. Nah, yeah. Okay, so I'll just attack the leftmost acolyte. I deal magic damage, so I should do more t to the chaos leader in the middle, but I think we still probably want to focus on one enemy at a time. Mm -hmm. So I think I'll still... <laughs> Let's see. I think I'll probably not use the party heal. We might die, but that's okay. I'd save that for the inevitable dungeon we might be able to go into. Yeah, I mean, the oh, party attacking heal... me? Ouch. Yeah, we're probably going to be fine. Now, did he strike so hard nah. that I missed my turn? Is that what happened? Or no, now I have a turn. That does happen. It'll say interrupted or stunned. Hit the leftmost one. Finish Hit the, on. the acolyte? Yeah. Yeah. The only okay. reason why I was hitting the guy with the shield is I have the chance of hitting the both. AOE. Yeah. Yeah, the AoE is um, only if all of them succeed, so it's, it's a big risk. Nice. Oh, steadfast. Hey. Nice. Yeah, like called shot, which you have, will occasionally activate and make a critical. Uh, steadfast will occasionally activate and block a move. Now, if I choose the snipe shot, but I boost it with... Oh, I don't have any focus left, do yeah, I? Yeah, you don't have, don't have any focus. 31% uh, chance to pierce armor is still not bad, but it depends on what your like, damage is without doing that. It's only six, either one. So I it's probably... Pierce. Go with the pierce. The snipe shot? I think okay. so. I can try it. Let's see if it works. Ah, oh, yeah, blocks. It, it has a lower chance of success, but like if the other one was successful, it wasn't going to do that much damage. So, mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, pretty much had. Well. <laughs> ah. <laughs> All right. Uh, you just have to hit him. Maybe just pick the non-pierce one. <laughs> yep, that's what I'll do. There we go. Goodbye. Woohoo! Victory. Oh, a book of lore. lore. I guess the lore payouts are better. A bar yeah. bat. Twice Wait, as much. I think that's...
Oh, it's it's a it's a minstrel thing, isn't it? It if my talent were better, I could consider it. Yeah, actually, that Wander actually... has the highest talent. It's <laughs> yeah, pretty give me good. <laughs> Should I give it to you? Yeah. Do you want it? I don't. It's, it's probably better can than you what I got. Can you wield it? Really? Yeah. I'm gonna. Yeah, I can. You can. So anyone can wield anything. Your stats are those. So um, I'm passing. Things listed so he under can do name. it, right? You see how like Wander's got like. Like a strength of seventy six is that like bottom left most stat with the arm muscle? Oh, I see. So yeah, this one it has the juggler. So mine yeah. is sixty five, but his is seventy two. How did he get that? Is I'm it gonna... are, are our stats randomly rolled? I'll collect that one. I I think different characters have different stat values. Ooh. The fancy rough party evasion luck and a gold to... multiplier. Uh, who has the highest luck? Give that to Shell, I think. Luck is yeah. the four-leaf clover. I'm at 51. I'm only one point ahead of you guys. Go ahead and take it, though. I do think I equip yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, just equip it. Because we'll want that gold multiplier anyways. Okay, thank goodness I don't actually have the rough on me. <laughs> <laughs> no, it doesn't change your appearance. I think the, the um, armor and other things do, though. Yeah, I guess you can I see that. I think the hat did. Yeah, the absolutely. hat did. Yeah. Thanks for dealing with those pointy hat had it weirdos, but I have a feeling we haven't seen the last of them. Chaos reduced. Yeah. The chaos has diminished. We have a chance. Whee! And I still have a move? Yes. Where do we want to go? Uh, do we want to go for the bear, or do we want to go for the bandits? Or do we right. heal up? <laughs> so, one of us wants to get to that sanctum of life. And the reason for this is having bonus health and health regen is, I think, obvious. But the other one is it adds you an extra life, essentially, because if that character dies, they lose the buff rather than losing a life. I only have one more move, so should I just get closer to you guys? Head north? Um, I mean, probably we want to hit up Orton and rest and okay. buy equipment and stuff. Oh, that's another move that comes up for your character. You have an extra move. Oh, I have an extra move. Yeah, okay. just randomly I on. Oh, looks like that's it. All right. So, but you can only have one, um, like, sanctum at a time. Mm -hmm. So, like, whoever gets that won't be able to take another one unless they die and probably will want to distribute them. Uh... So, I don't know, Wanda, you're, you're closest to it. If you want to just go for it, that's fine. Um, I think I... it's probably six to one, half a dozen of the other. I'm not going to be able to reach it quite yet. No, but we want to we want to have someone get that sooner than later. If you want to leave okay. it for me, I can give it a shot, but yeah, you can just I'll grab hit it. it up. Ooh. We got a creature, uh, Beastman, just spawned right next to us. So if you guys guy? can <laughs> beat it in battle, you will level up? Yeah. No, probably not. We're a little far from that, actually. Yeah. Yeah. I think we okay. can probably take him, though, Shell, right? Uh, we probably can. Yeah. Especially if it's just him. Let's see, what's my ambush chance? Not good. I'm gonna fight him. Well, you get to go first anyway, so... Okay, um, well, I just a shot. Probably regular shot, yeah. Ouch. You'll be resting it in shortly. Mm -hmm. That was my plan. There we go. Ooh, nice. Was it just the like extra magic bonus that really got that, or did you put some? I you didn't have any oh. points to dedicate to it, didn't you? Uh, yeah. There's no focus. I just happened to roll well. The focus uh. only like helps guarantee a move. It yeah. doesn't mm -hmm. like it'll never make you deal more damage. So effectively, what it is is it's like rolling a d6. If you spend a focus, you automatically roll a six. Mm -hmm. If that makes a se any sense. Uh, let's see. So it's still your turn, Nathan? Yeah. yeah, I was just quickly looking at whether or not there was any int-based weapons, because my current one is not great. But there are not any, so hopefully we can find something. Um, my monitor hates this game. <laughs> oh? I think I'm just going to buy a couple of the god's beards, actually. 
wander, it's doing the thing where the lower half of the screen is flickering with the top of the UI. Oh. So, it's interesting. Uh, actually, I maybe that was the wrong thing. Shell, could you give me four gold? Oh, how do I do that? If you click on your gold, you should be able to give gold to me. Let's see, where is the gold on my page? I see. Share gold. Uh, it looks like I can give you... How much do you need? Only four. Okay. It's probably better than trying to wait for the level up. Okay. And that's all my moves. All right, so then I go to Orton, probably? Um, yeah, I mean, you can check out... I, I didn't look to see if there are any... I think there are some weapons you could use, like a quarter staff, actually. Oh, but you might not be able to afford it. Mm -hmm. Resting might just make sense, though. Okay, I, mean, I can look at the market. The only thing I see, no, there's herbs. Everything else is too expensive at the moment. Yeah, I, you can't buy an herb, though, can you? Probably you just want to rest at the inn, though. I, I could buy one herb. It would take everything that I had, though, and then I wouldn't be able to stay at the inn, would I? Yeah, because yeah. the inn is five. <laughs> With the level up coming, it's almost a good idea. <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, I think avoiding the chance of death makes sense. I think I can hit that roadside grave, and with my intelligence, I'll probably have a better chance of succeeding at that. Oh. Would you be able to get an item or something, like a boost of some sort from it? Um, yeah, I think they have items typically. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it does have the mind focus. So, oh. Have I not got gotten this yet? I have not gotten this yet. I was going to say, I feel like your first move is pretty clear. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, oh, an alluring pool. Oh, yeah, it's I a guess fast travel system. I, I bought a bunch of things in the store, and it seems like all the things I got are here. So More beastmen. See, I could get to that roadside grave. Oh, it looks like I could hit that beast man, though. Mm, well, but if I you hit the roadside if grave. you hit the Timberwolf camp, you might include the beastman warrior in it. I don't yeah. think I can get there. I'm gonna hit up the roadside grave because you guys can both. Okay. Oh, the Good. gallows! Oh, That's a level two, so we should wait a little bit on that guy. Oh, I'm just gonna pump two into this thing. I think. Nice. Well, you get to get the best. There's my level, level up. up. That's the focus. I think that was it, though. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, more beastmen are emerging. If you ambush them, you don't have to fight all of them. But I think a combat's in order. Yeah. Okay. So if you attack the beastmen that you're right next to. This one? Yeah. Uh, but then it'll I'm, fight. I'll be attacking from the city, though. Is that possible? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. And that'll I... pull in all of us. It looks like I can go next to you, but between the two beastmen. But then you I would actually attack. be passing through the beastman warrior and fighting him anyway. I made that okay. mistake earlier. Ah, so mm. I should just attack the guy immediately next to the city. Yes. Yeah. All right. And do I try to ambush him? I don't. I have to focus. What's your chance of success for ambush? So it's 50, forty-seven. It's fifty-fifty. You know, I think don't, because we want to hit both of them. That's like yeah. still a pretty easy fight for a 3v2. So just a fight? Yeah, I think so. And the chance is not good unless you use focus. And I think we've got some tough fights coming up. Although mm -hmm. you're close to a level, so. OK, now they're both considered armored. Should I try okay. piercing shot? I think the two armor, it's iffy to try the piercing shot, because it's got a lower chance of succeeding. So yeah. the two armor just I'll is going to block two damage from you. So you just kind of have to balance, is it worth the risk of missing? Is it worth? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think one of the big factors is actually if you put them down to six and I have a full success on mine, that's enough for me to kill one of them. <laughs> so... Yeah, do I use focus? Uh, I'll just roll the dice. There Do we, we get more abilities as time goes on? Uh, it's based on your weapon. Sense. Oh, the weapon. I see. Yeah. 
Like the snipe shot is a weapon thing. Oh yeah, you have your your loot with you, don't you? Yes. I'm just trying <laughs> to understand it. <laughs> it has a few different ah. attack types. Um, you you can see the chance of a success for like certain. Like it always tells you the percent chance for each roll. Mm -hmm. And then often if it has an ability, it usually only activates if all are successful. Oh, nice. A whiff. Yeah, so he probably has an ability that only activates if all all yeah, of those roles successful. Judging so. by the icons, he was trying to stun you, maybe. Mhm. Mm oh, that's funny. <laughs> it's just really awkward. You do a little jig. Do, 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 do. I'm gonna try collecting it and see if I get the extra gold. Or wait, the the gold multiplier Shell has, doesn't she? So I should just always give it to her, shouldn't I? I have an uh, even bigger oh, gold multiplier. Oh, I have the rough, don't I? Oh, right, She's got a little bit. I've got more. Uh, let's okay. See. We should put the rough on Wander then and stack gold multipliers for as long as that um, and let Wander collect all the gold. Oh, uh, so I should be able to give him my rough? Is that what you're asking for? Yeah, How about... it, if that's Leather Vest is sitting on you at the moment, though, Shell, you should just equip that. Okay. Uh, should... Wander's going to be beefy I'd... enough as it is. I can't so select I, I'm going to pass though. on it. Yeah. So she okay. can have it. 